What's up everybody? My name's Cap, the Everyday Gamer, and welcome back to Minecraft. Um, I had originally planned on, or at least thought about, trying to head out into the world and do some exploring in this episode, but I've been making some good progress on my house, and so I thought I'd just kind of keep going with that for the moment, and, you know, we'll just uh, see how it goes, and, you know, from there I might, after this I might move out into the world a little bit, but I was making some good progress with my new home, which after I'm done I'm going to tear this monstrosity down. Uh, well, plus I'll probably need some of the resources for it. So anyway, just kind of show you what I've got so far. Um, I ended up tearing down what I had first started and scooted it out a little bit because I was kind of doing some eyeballing and, you know, originally it started like right here. It wasn't going to give me much room and I ended up just like running it into the castle wall and having this tiny little house. So that's what I have so far, really. There's not much to it. Oh, and you'll notice my texture for my glasses back to normal because, well, I got the new update, the, let's see, what is it? 1.2.3 fixed a few of the little bugs from 1.2 which you know thank you guys so much for all the support and the uh, update video I did it's nice to know that you know guys are watching it I'm just doing steps on this I'm not gonna worry about that side right now but that way I can get up and down kinda looks pretty <laughs> sound like Bob Ross actually I've had quite a few people tell me I sound like Bob Ross which you know what I'm okay with that's not an insult to me Bob Ross is a cool cat yo Aww. I clicked too fast. Whoops, wrong one. Okay, I'm scrolling too fast for it. <laughs> so how are you guys doing? I'm doing quite well myself. Wife and little man are at her uh, parents' house this morning. A lot of times on Sunday mornings, more often than not, they go over there and have breakfast and just kind of give um, her parents a way to spend some time with little man too. And, you know, it's fun for her. And so, you know, Sunday's my day to sleep in. So it kind of gives me an extra day, or a little bit of extra time to work on a video or something if I want to, and well, so that's what I'm doing. just thought I would uh, put out, or work on a video and give me a chance to kind of get some stuff going. So yeah, this is kind of what I have as far as the house. It's going to be a two-story house, which I really have never made that much of before. I mean, I don't think I've ever made one that was a true two-story, you know, having like a second floor that you could walk on. It's not something I've ever done, and I wish I would quit clicking in the wrong friggin' spot. <laughs> oh, um, if you're playing at home and you're not just downloading the world or whatever, right over that direction, see, so you kind of jump over there. There's a lot of trees over there, so you can get a lot of wood. You can see I got, I got quite a few more left over, and I got, you know, just a bunch of extra woods in there. Sun's getting ready to go down, so I'll probably go hit up the bed real quick just so I can keep it from being dark. Yes, I still need to put up a bunch of torches and stuff too, but you know, we'll get there eventually. So I'm gonna try and remember at the after this video to go back and redo my glass texture just to uh make it so it's nice and pretty and clean. And I might you know, since I still need to do that um tutorial on how to do that, I'm I might try and record that too while I'm doing it, just to make life easy for me. But we'll see. So what have you guys been up to, huh? Let me see, this last week, you know, it was busy, I took off on Friday, basically I stayed home all day just to work on my taxes, you know, that stuff's not fun at all, but it's just, you know, one of those things you gotta do as an adult, and, you know, I own a business, and, you know, we do charitable donations and stuff, so my taxes usually take me all day, unlike a lot of people's that you can do a 1040 easy and call it good. Oh, and I saw a comment posted, yes, I always just jump off the roof instead of going down the stairs, because why not, it's fun. <laughs> I know I have the ladder over there, so it, I have the ladder over there so I can climb up, not so I can climb down. Okay, let's see here. Nah, I'm not going to work on that back part yet. I need to work on the the roof. Okay, so this whole area is going to be... Uh, see, I did it again. And again. Oh my god. That's the right <laughs> I'm going to just set fire to the house and call it good. Oh, what a moron. It's okay though. Got some nice uh, lulling music playing while I'm doing some building here. So anyway, um, yeah, really not much going on in my world. Um, got taxes done, so I was able to stop and play some games and um, played some Battlefield 3 for a little while. I had to play solo, didn't really have anybody on at that moment to play with me. And I had one guy jump on and uh, send me an invite, but I was already in the middle of a... I just started a new mission, so I didn't want to back all the way out. Um, other than that, I didn't really play anything, and so for the people wanting me to put up another Battlefield video, I promise as soon as I have more time to play and not suck at it, 
I will definitely try and get another video up. But right now, <laughs> I, I think I'm just now like a rank 2 or something. Um, I think I have like one gun with an actual scope on it. And so, uh, yeah, I kind of suck at the game still. And so it would basically just be a, a long video of watching me run around getting shot at. And, now, I did, you know, get a few takeouts and stuff. I took out a tank once or twice. And, you know, I don't, I'm not completely horrible at the game. Because I'm, you know, it's a first person shooter and I'm kind of used to those for sure. But it's, I'm not wonderful at it by any means. So, yeah, there's that. Let's see here. Make this go out this way. Far back doesn't go. Uh, doesn't matter. Man, there was a lot of stuff added in the 1.2 update. I'm glad you guys, or glad so, so many of you, actually checked out the update video to kind of you know see all the stuff that's in there. I always like doing those to be able to show off all the stuff that's been added to the world and. You know, one, it kind of gives me a way to learn it, too, because I have to do all the research on what was added before I can obviously do the video. And then to try and find some of the stuff, it takes a little while to put those videos together. To find the right spots and to be able to get what if, you know, say if it's one of those instances, like, okay, so the new update they broke, they added so zombies can break down the door on hard. Like, well, that's still one of those things I have to actually find. <laughs> you know, it, it can't just spawn into one of my normal worlds and... Poof! A magic zombie appears and breaks down the door. Okay, I'm gonna put up a few torches and stuff in here. Keep it from being too dark if the sun starts to go down. I don't want things spawning inside my house already. So just from the basic layout of what I've got going on here, has anybody figured out what I'm building from? I mean, where I'm getting my inspiration from my house? If you do, just uh, post in the comments below, and if anybody gets it right, then the next video I'll say yay or nay. I'm not going to answer it in the comments, just because I don't want to give it away just yet. If, uh, you know, until I'm done. But I think what I'll do is the next, um, is I'll work on the, the, this, I can't talk this morning. <laughs> the coffee hasn't kicked in fully yet. Um, I'll work on this some more after i finish finished the, this video, and I'll try and get the house actually finished itself. Let's see, this is going to be, uh, let's top of the stairs, we'll start the wall right there. Oops. Okay, let's do this. Hey, check this out. Shift click. Ha! Huh. See, I do know how to do it, I just don't like doing it. <laughs> Whoa, hello. Thank you, camera. Appreciate that. It's always fun when that happens. This room really is not going to have a whole lot to it. This is just going to be a sort of like a bedroom, if you will. And I'll worry about redoing doors and windows and crap afterwards. But for now I'm just kind of getting a basic structure down so you guys can see it. And what my vision of what this place is going to look like when I get done. Alright, let's see. Good time so far. Alrighty then, that works pretty good. Uh, you know what? I kind of want to do a balcony. I think a balcony sounds nice. Let's see, we'll put a door right here. We're going to do a two wide door. Let's see, I've already got the base for it, so let's do it this way. It's going to be a tiny little balcony, I guess, but oh well. Let's see, um, no, nah, I don't think it's going to be a full wrap around balcony. So we'll make it stop right there. There, so it's an actual sort of true balcony. I, I don't know many houses that have a wrap around balcony that goes the entire length all the way around the house upstairs. Now there's a lot of, you know, southern plantations and stuff that have them upstairs too, but this ain't a southern plantation. I'm in a castle. Oh, and if you want to know, I'm like shift walking and stuff right now so I don't fall. And that'll be good on that one. Sweet. Check it out. Got a nice little balcony. Alright. Rolling in style. <laughs> oh, sorry. I thought I heard somebody talking outside. Probably my neighbors are out doing some yard work. Which I need to do some yard work. Huh. 
Oh yeah, well I'm not going to be able to walk on this when I'm done anyway. Banzai! That is nice about having the little food meter. I don't have to worry about dying every time I fall off of something, as long as the food's full. Alrighty then. Okay, let's see. I think I'm going to take this all the way out to the back here. I have it circled around this way. No. No. Jesus, what I stopped clicking that. Okay, and then this will be out this way. Oh, um, some I've had quite a few people recommend that I use the Optifine mod, you know, to check it out or whatever like that. Um, I'm not against something like that where it just makes the FPS feel a little bit better. I just haven't had a chance to. That's the main reason why. I'm something like that where it uh, changes visuals and stuff. I'm not against to using it and stuff. So um, that's that's the reason why I haven't really done it yet. It's just I hadn't thought about it, hadn't had a chance to look into it a little bit further. I guess is the reason why. And uh, once I get completely done with the house, I'll probably add, you know, or and, and when I get some more resources, I'll probably do some more textures and stuff for it. But, you know, right now, that's... Oh, I fell off. Um, right now, I'm just going to leave it basically as all wood and dirt. That's how I do all my builds, basically, is I just start off with, you know, the basic structure of crap. And where's the sun at? Okay. And just call it good from there. And... Well, this is kind of how it's going to be, you know, have my nice little living room, which once I get to the ceiling here, and the living room, and then I have this, you know, like a back patio, kind of circles around to like a kitchen dining room area here, and then you head upstairs, and this is going to be like a my bedroom, got the nice little balcony here to walk around on, pretty cool, huh? Okay, like I said, don't want it to go all the way around. What is this? Oh, yeah. Durr, I know what that is. <laughs> Alright, well, not much going on in this episode. I realize that. I know it's kind of boring. Oh, I haven't done anything extra with the castle either. I've still got these two things. I haven't changed the walkway at all. But um, I am going to do a stone walkway on both sides. Somebody recommend... Here, let me just walk over so I can show you. Uh, while I'm talking. Uh, somebody recommended I do a stone walkway on both sides so it keeps the spiders from scaling my castle. Um, I am going to do that. See, kind of like this. I mean, I will put cobblestone all the way around. Um, I didn't necessarily mean I was going to do a fence fence. I meant, like, hypothetically, it's just going to fall, but wee! But put one, like, right there and stuff all the way down so it's one block. Why did I click so fast? Put it like this all the way around of cobblestone so it's kind of got a little fence there so I can jump on it, but it kind of looks like that castle look, you know? So that's kind of what I was referring to. Yeah, not much really going on so far in this episode. My house is basically twice as big as all the other houses in the entire village combined, but you know Aww. Oh. That kinda sucked, didn't it? Alright, well. Let's see. I think this is a good spot to block back in if I wanted to. Yep. Okay. Uh where's my cobblestone? cover that back up. That, oh, by the way, anytime I do a big build project, it's funny is I always get comments of people saying, how do you get out? You know, like this giant wall. And like, where's the door to get out? Or my house video and stuff, people are asking me, how do you get outside? Just punch a hole in the wall. It's pretty simple. <laughs> I don't mean to, you know, insult anybody, but that's how I do it. I don't have doors on every side of the, the uh, area there, so if you just um, want to know how to get out, just punch a hole in the wall and fill it back in when you're done. Nice. Okay, this video is getting a little bit long and not much done to it, but I promise, guys, next time I will venture out. We'll go do some more exploring. I just wanted to work on the house, and uh, I have so many people that want to see me do some building stuff, so that's what I'm doing. And, uh, well, there you have it. I still need to clean up the village a little bit. I've got some grass to mow, and yes, I'm going to do some farming. Oh, I am going to do a tree farm, too. I just haven't figured out where, so i get my animal farm over here, which I still need to get some sheep for, and got my cobblestone generator over here, which, see, when you have the texture on the glass, you see, it just doesn't look as pretty. It's all snowy looking. It looks frosted over, so that's one reason why I like the smooth, clear glass, just so I can see it. But anyway, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video here, and... 
and we'll just uh, call it good. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for all the support again, and you know I appreciate you still watching my videos. You know I I make these for fun, but if people stop watching them, then it's no longer fun, really. So I appreciate everybody that's enjoying them and leaving feedback and rating the videos and all that other stuff. You know how much I appreciate that, guys. I'm not very subtle about saying thank you. So anyway, I'm going to continue to work on my house a little bit and get it all nice and prettied up a little bit. And then next video, we will head out into the world. In the meantime, you guys take it easy. Have a great day.